Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I am so excited because we're doing something very, very fun, and that is creating Quidditch posts. So we can play Quidditch at home. Jonathan and I decided that it would be fun to make full posts for the backyard, and we did it a little different than um, sometimes I've seen online, but I don't want anyone to get discouraged and think that the way we did it is too hard because it actually was super simple. And since there is so many different ways to do it, you don't have to do it the way we did, but it's just what we decided to do. I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys how we did our Quidditch posts, and then we're gonna play a little bit of Quidditch in our backyard. For these Quidditch posts, we decided to use wood for the stands instead of like PVC pipe or anything else. We just thought that it worked best because Jonathan, as you guys know, has his little wood shop and he has become a woodworker. So because of that, we went with this route of creating the posts. So the first thing that Jonathan did was I started with the shorter posts, so I cut two of the two by, two by fours down to two pieces at 38 inches. And then I rough cut the second two by four into two 48 inch pieces. And then once I had all those pieces, I ripped them in half. So instead of two by fours, now they're two by twos. And that will give you um, pretty, pretty much all the, the post parts you need. And then um, once I had those, I rough cut the two by eight into six pieces at seven and a half inches. And then, um, yeah, and then those are all the bases. And then we pre-drilled the holes in the bottom of them. And that's where your screws are gonna go to attach the post to the base. And once we had all of those pre-drilled, we attached them all. And that's pretty much it. And then we sprayed the hooves. Yeah, so then while Jonathan was assembling all the rest of the posts, I went and spray painted all of the hula hoops. So I just sprayed them like one coat on each side. I just sprayed one, flipped it over, then sprayed the other side. There's some spots on it that you can still see like the original hula hoop design, so it's not perfect. If I wanted to, I can go back in and make it look really nice, but um, I just didn't. We just assembled them after that, so. Then Jonathan screwed holes from the hula hoop into the posts to make them stand up straight. And yeah, that is pretty much it. It probably took less than an hour to complete everything. It was super quick, a lot easier and quicker than it sounds in the way like I feel like it looks on paper because mm -hmm. we'll put everything in the description like step by step how we did everything. And um, also the link, we saw this on Pinterest. So I'll pin that and that's where we got the original idea from. So we will link that, but yeah, super easy. And now we have our six posts in our backyard and then now we can go and play. So for our quaffle today, I have an actual quaffle. You don't need one. You could easily use like a volleyball or any kind of ball just to throw through the hoops. So I have an actual quaffle though, so we're gonna be using that. And then as our bludger, I have a volleyball because I don't have any other kind of ball. So, so we're gonna be using a, Lily's really excited to play Quidditch. Wow. Are you so excited? So I have a volleyball that we're gonna use to be a bludger. And then for our golden snitch, what we decided to do was use, Lily has a yellow Easter egg because she still plays with all her Easter eggs. So we just used a yellow one and we're going to use that as our golden snitch. Yeah. And a fun thing that you can do with that, which we were reading, 
was you can like put stuff in it if you're like having a birthday party or like something where you're playing with a bunch of people and you could put stuff in it and then just hide it and then someone has to go and like hunt for the egg so that's kind of fun since it's just us playing it's gonna obviously not be like the original quidditch game but you know we're gonna do what we can with what we have so Right, guys we just finished playing quidditch and as you guys could see we had so much fun like that was so much more fun than i even thought it was going to be just because it was i don't know and it was just me and jonathan so we were just being super silly and it was really fun i highly recommend making some type of quidditch posts for your house so you can play with your family because that was really cool. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my YouTube channel if you want to see new videos weekly that are mostly Harry Potter related. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys next time with a new video. Bye!